play. I did hear that shit. It is the most amazing live concert I've ever seen. Really? It's not, it's not even close. The only person you and can compare And you've seen Beyonce. To, no, son, yeah. I've seen Beyonce. No, you haven't. I've seen Beyonce. I've seen Beyonce. But here's the thing. Here's the thing. There's no question Beyonce is a a much better dancer. There's no question that much better uh, singer. She's a much better singer. There's no question. Yeah. Beyonce is a generational talent. It's, yeah. it's, 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 a, a talent like Beyonce does not come along. What I'm what I'm trying to say is you're doing a disservice to Beyonce to compare her to Taylor Swift. Because Taylor is in another galaxy. Yeah, yeah. You know, yo, all jokes aside. I, 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 and I mean this, and this is going to hurt feelings here, but I don't even like comparing them because Beyonce is, you get that once in a generation, maybe once in a century, you get a Beyonce, right? Absolutely. So I, I, I hate the comparison. It sucks we have to compare them, but she's not even... It's not even... Salute to my Taylor, boy. Taylor's sort of put out so... Like, you don't realize when you sit there, I was a Taylor hater. I'm going there because my wife wants to go, and I'm like, I've been making fun of this girl for a decade. I've been hating on her. I felt like such a phony. Within one song, I'm standing up. I knew you were trouble, trouble when, when you walked, walked in. <laughs> Listen, I'm, salute to my boy, Frosty, man. Frosty listened to the last episode of Brilliant News, and he texted me, uh, uh, of a news report of how it said Beyonce's tour is going to gross $500 million. It's like the highest...